everyone. Today we're here at the library and today we're doing Big Brother Win Chapter 2 Animals. So let's get into the video. This video is about sharks, the most ferocious predators. When do sharks breed? Then did I see the shark? Oh, wow. When do sharks breed? Are they told when they are warm when it? When do sharks breed? You're about to find out in, in today's video. When do sharks breed? Scientists determined that sharks existed, existed some 200 million years ago before dinosaurs in, in, emerged. Sharks are among the oldest creatures on our planet. In Cleveland, Ohio, scientists have found fossils of sharks that are believed to be 400 million years ago. Whoa, that's so cool! You can see the shark's fossil in the Museum of Ohio. Do you guys know that Cleveland is the shark capital? Now let's go to Tiger Beach, which is a small, pristine, white and beach in the Bahamas. It's one of the few places in the world where you can dive with tiger sharks. It is located on the west end of Grand Bahama Island. The Bahamas are a chain of islands that are located at the coast of Florida in the United States. And they're one of the few places on Earth where you can see at least five different species of sharks. All at the same time, wow, this is super amazing. When are sharks active? People used to think that if a shark stopped moving, it could not breathe and would drown. This is only true for some sharks. Sharks remove oxygen from the water in order to breathe. Water enters the shark's mouth and floats around the gills. Inside the gills are hundreds of feathery filaments that contain blood vessels. These blood vessels absorb oxygen from the water as it passes by. Keeping the oxygen flow. Yeah. If you have a picture of a shark, then only at the same blood. Oxygen the focus border is little flaming, flaming. Oxygen drips water, little arches, wind, winter, and ultra, and heart. Now, time to another question. What is, are white sharks warm-blooded or full-blooded? Actually, white sharks are much more complex than you may think. White sharks are laminate sharks, which have a unique system called a counter current heat exchange, keeping their body warmer than the outside conditions by plus slash minus 10 to 15 Celsius. So if a white shark in, is in 9 Celsius water, its body temperature will be between 19 to 24 Celsius and so on. The generator of all the heat comes from the one muscles running down the length of their body, which charge a tour of white muscles. Ready for the swift burst of energy? even in cold environment. The shorts that use these techniques include the dirt, angel, and carpet shorts. They do not need to swim to breathe. Other shorts are called obligate rain breeders. These shorts must swim or they will drown. But 24 short species, including the great white and mottle, are obligate rain breeders. Whoa, that's so cool. It's time to explore the deep ocean and find out if the sharks really are falling asleep. Shh, I found a lemon shark and it looks that she's sleeping. Wow, what an exciting view. After we shorts are able to engage in period of deep rest while still, but do not fall asleep in the traditional sense.
Ew, it looks like she doesn't brush her teeth. That's a bad. It takes more effort for a shark to remain still than to swim. Black and Iris, their eyes remain perpetually open and their pupils still monitor the motion of where they just swimming around them. It's me, she can still see me and attend a chat. Oops, let's go now. It takes more effort for a shark to remain still than to swim because all the different breeders are constantly on the move. They sleep very little. But the scientists can't watch every shark every second of the day. It is hard to know whether sharks take short now. It is possible that they are able to shut off their brains and rest while they are swimming. In addition to those senses, we have sight, hearing, touch, smell, and taste. Shorts have two other senses mediated by specialized receptors that I call electroreceptors and lateral lines. This highly tuned sense in, extends to countless small pores located throughout the short stint, mostly concentrated around the snout. These gel filled pores help amplify these weak electrical signals a while to catch a bit. Wow, this video is amazing. Well, and that's the end of the episode. And I'll see you guys next time. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.